Hello, everyone. My name is Soleil, and this is the premiere video for my brand new YouTube channel. I felt really called to start this channel, as many of you have probably found my work on Twitter, or maybe you are a student of mine or someone who has worked with me in the past. And I have found in all of my various outlets that there is a desire and a need for a little bit of a deeper dive into the kinds of things that we talk about in these spaces. The pillars for me for this channel are primarily spirituality and alchemy and self-mastery. And to me, all three of which are tools and means of traveling into what I believe we are building as the new paradigm, something that we're still kind of figuring out what that even means and what it's going to look like. I like to believe that it is a new world and a new way of doing things and a new way of coexisting and operating and new priorities, all new everything, basically. Um, and I really believe that the work starts with yourself. And so for me and my journey, that has really been the case. That has been how I have found my way on my own path. I started with spirituality very young, the healing arts very young. My mother taught me energy healing as a young child. She was very deep into spirituality, had a super amazing, powerful relationship to God. And so all of those things were presented to me at a very young age and held the space for me to find them on my own. She was an amazing guide for me because instead of telling me what was right for me, she allowed me to discern that for myself starting very young. And um, parallel to her journey, I too found a very deep relationship to spirituality, a very deep relationship to the healing arts, to a higher power. And fast forward then to 2012, I had what I consider my awakening. It was essentially a weekend where a number of things came together in such a perfect divine way that I kind of woke up to who I really am, to my, what I like to call divine assignment. And from there, it was sort of like I was on the clock. I I really um, understood the power that I have to help the world to become something different, to maybe lead the world in a different direction. And so I felt that immediately my first responsibility was to figure out what that meant for myself to kind of clear out the parts of me that is not me to unlearn, right? There's a lot of unlearning on the spiritual path. And so I sort of unplugged from society for about three or four years. I was traveling to various places, living out of a suitcase and working remotely at the time, meditating four or five hours a day, really, really, really getting deep into myself and into my own practices and what all of this meant on an experiential level. Once I um, kind of came out of that, in fact, what, what ultimately pulled me out of that then was the death of my mother. She passed in 2016. And that was kind of like, obviously, another earthquake in my world. It took me out of kind of the whimsical spirit nature of the spiritual path and very much into the humanity of it. So I rooted down and kind of gave all of my energy into my own healing, obviously, and then into my career, which... Um, at the time and still is as an energy worker. I am a Reiki master, a meditation teacher, a yoga instructor, and so on. So deep into the healing arts, and that's definitely where my passion lives. I've done a lot of sound healing and group events, and you know, I'm I'm very deep in the wellness space. And over the years, that's just kind of come with me. It's bloomed with me. It has evolved. My work has continued to evolve as I have evolved. And more recently, I've given a lot of my energy into my teaching. You, um, If you know me on Twitter, you have find that I talk a lot about this kind of stuff on Twitter. And I've, I've used that actually specifically last year as an outlet for, you know, helping us create a language for all of this to help normalize all of this in a different way and just be a resource on, you know, a, on this kind of mystical, non normal path. And so more recently, I have felt that there's been this deeper desire to dive, you know, a little further into these concepts to really 
uproot and unearth the gems that are waiting for us. I feel like a lot of what we're building now is actually kind of like ancient wisdom. It comes from that ancient understanding that we are connected to and are much larger than what we even realize and what we have the capacity to see with our physical senses. And to me, that's kind of what really weaves into then understanding yourself through self-mastery, through inner alchemy, and then the path of what I call spirituality, which is the development of the person, the self, the spirit, and relationship to a higher power, a divine design. So that will be the topics of discussion I hope to cover as much as I possibly can in this space. I hope you know that you are more than welcome here exactly as you are. I would love to include as many people as I can in this conversation as I continue to learn. You know, a lot of what I talk about is my own learnings too, just as much as, as it, I'm teaching anyone else, I'm teaching myself, talking to myself. So please you know, know that we are all in this together, that I'm really honestly just honored that you share this space with me. And I'm super excited to see where this takes us. Thank you, everyone. <laughs>